A teenage girl tells police that a man drugged her, abducted her from a neighborhood park in South Fulton County, and then assaulted her. Now, but tonight, Union City Police say that's not exactly what happened, and residents are breathing a sigh of relief. Fox 5's Angelique Proctor joins us live from the park at the center of this story. And Angelique, what do police say really did happen? Lots of late breaking developments. Union City Police are now saying this 16 year old made most of this story up. They say there was no kidnapping here at the Ronald Bridges Park. They also say that the suspect in this case did not present the victim with drug laced cookies, but they still believe she was a victim of a sexual assault. The neighbors and I, we kind of pride ourselves on the fact that we call it the South Fulton's best kept secret. We, we are family out here. The family of people who look out for each other around Ronald Bridges Park in Union City are relieved to learn there was no kidnapping here. A 16 year old girl initially made up a story about being abducted and given a drug laced cookie. But late this afternoon, Union City police set the record straight. Detectives now say the teen left the park voluntarily with her alleged assailant two Saturdays ago around 1130 when the park was closed. Officers are still investigating the case as a sexual assault, but they say the people who use and enjoy the park daily, like Arthur Sarita Robinson, have no reason to be alarmed. Um, I write books and I live right across the street and and for this, I'm always using something to help inspire me. It's helped save us because I have an autistic son. He's 10 years old and he goes over and he plays with his kids, other kids, and he makes friends. 